A very good day to all our viewers and thank you for tuning into Polymer Update TV, the world's first and only TV network with a free daily petrochemicals news show. We are thrilled to have you here and if you are keen to expand your knowledge by accessing our free news, please don't forget to subscribe. Your support is deeply appreciated by all of us at Polymer Update. Let us begin. You are watching the Petrochemical Market Synopsis with me Michelle Kim. It is Friday, April 28th. Let's start with energy news. Crude oil prices gained on Thursday following a decline in the number of people filing for unemployment benefits in the U.S. Brent crude prices rose by 68 cents settling at $78.37 per barrel. While WTI futures increased by 46 cents settling at $74.76 per barrel. On Thursday, OpenSpec NAP the prices fell sharply by $15 per metric ton at the $643 per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. In high-density polyethylene This week, HDPE prices down adjusted in the European region on account of limited buying activity prompted by a weak demand sentiment. Prices fell further as a result of an oversupply situation exacerbated by excess import cargoes from Middle Eastern suppliers. In the spot markets, HDPE film grade prices were assessed at the €1,225 to €1,235 per metric ton FD Northwest Europe levels, a fall of €15 Euros per metric ton from last week. Meanwhile, HDPE BM grade prices were assessed at the €1,215 Euros to €1,225 Euros per metric ton FD Northwest Europe levels, a week on week decline by €30 Euros per metric ton while HDPE injection grade prices were assessed at the €1,175 to €1,185 per metric ton FD Northwest Europe levels, a decrease of €15 Euros per metric ton from the previous week. Moving on to the weekly market updates for polypropylene and polyvinyl chloride in Europe and the US. Polypropylene in Europe, this week, PP prices decreased in Europe. Polyvinyl chloride in Europe, this week, PVC spot prices down adjusted in Europe. Polypropylene in the US, this week, PP export prices were assessed as steady in the United States. Polyvinyl chloride in the US, this week, PVC export prices declined in the United States. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video on Monday to know more. This is Polymer Update, with me Michelle Kim, from Polymer Update's Virtual World. Many thanks for watching.